you made up uh, your mind about the general election? Yeah, definitely gonna vote. Did you check the website? No, no. This man hasn't checked the register. This is what I would like to have seen. So you're on the register? Mm. You checked I, it? I checked the register and I'm on it. Mm. That's, that's good going. Yeah. Now that's much better. See how happy they were? That was all wrong. What we need to see is that again, except with much more empathy for the actors. So you're on the register? Mm. I don't want to see that. Check the register and I'm on it. That guy hasn't checked the register. <laughs> Wrong, wrong, wrong. Uh, popping up like that is just confusing the public, it's confusing the message. Sorry, but no. This is how you do it. It's getting there. That's not how you do it. Not, not in my business. Perfect. That's how you do it. In, and in, and out. Which way are we looking? <clears throat> we're, here, we're here to ask the politicians and political leaders tough questions. These are the types of questions that politicians fear. Who, what are your top the three politicians of all time. Mm. That's a great question. We'll come back to that. Would you answer the question? Stop interrupting me. One, two, three. So, so how, how are you going to fix, fix the country? country? Mm. That's interesting. I would draw your attention. So, so how are you going to fix the country? Draw your attention to some. So how, how are you going to fix the country? It's a yes or no answer. It's a yes or no it's answer. It's a simple question. Yes or no? Are you going to fix the country? Yes. This one here I got for recently fixing Egypt. What about the environment? Are you going to fix that? Hmm. Well, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Would you hold my hands? Okay. Close your eyes. Dream. Close your eyes, please. Please, it doesn't work otherwise. Bank holidays, how often do they come? And are you going to increase their... Well, uh, or given what's happened with the banks, I don't think we should be dictated to by them when we take our holidays. I'm proposing, what are you going to do about the banks? I'm proposing a three-day working week with the rest of the seven or eight days off and people can do as they wish. They can be creative and artistic and free. Hold on, we've got a Skype call coming in. Um, it's uh, from Enda Kenny, who couldn't make it tonight. Hello, Enda. Uh, where are you now? Um, I think I'm at a, I think I'm at a, 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 a public rally down in, uh, I think it's Sligo Leitrim. Uh, I wonder, do you have a minute just to answer a couple of quick questions? That doesn't fit into my schedule at all. I actually have a very, a very, <laughs> a very busy schedule around the country. He's gone. That's a pity. But it does look like we have uh, the Jedwards. Who are you going to vote for, boys? Well, number one, Britney Spears, really nice Miley Cyrus, and really nice teeth. Good. I like Hammer Diaz, I like Denise Richards, I like Britney Spears. Thanks for that. Do you want to do the rap now? Yeah. I'm Ivan Morphy Richardson. My story is short and sweet and fast. We're coming up on polling day. The die will soon be cast. Both the man with the double barrel, shotgun name to blast those bastards into the past. That's great. This Friday, there's going to be a general election. It's happening this Friday. There's going to be a general election. It's as easy as one, two, three. Vote well, as many times as you like. Because everyone comes. comes. Our computer experts are standing by to count the votes. Who will I vote for? Fine Gael. I'm voting independent. Labour? Don't be People say voting is boring, but it's not. It's fun for all the family. Hmm. What's the point of this election? Well, if you win, you get to do this. One, lads. Hey, take it over there.